Hey, it's Tim here, coach and co-founder of the Extraordinary Life Revolution. And today I've got a question for you. Are you creating or consuming? Now this one goes out to the business owners and entrepreneurs out there. And this came off the back of a great conversation I had with a good mate of mine who is crushing it and he's an Aussie entrepreneur. And had a great conversation with him today. And he was struggling and he asked me a question. How, does, how do you get onto social media? And he always feels like he's bludging and he's not working when he's on social media. So I, I posed him to a question, and the question was, are you creating or are you consuming? And he got it straight away, and a bit of a light bulb went off for him, and he thought, that little mindset, mindset shift has totally transformed how he views social media. And maybe you're an entrepreneur, and you think that social media, you should be doing more, and you're not doing enough. And you see these people out there who are you know, posting all the time and they're adding great value to the marketplace and you feel like you're missing the boat a little bit, but you find it hard to get the motivation to do it. Or you're on there like like he he was, and he was saying that he was bludging or just not putting in the work. You know, He feels like he's just scrolling through, and we've all been there. Now, the conversation isn't around are you creating or, convers- are, you creating or are you consuming, but how much of each? Now. If you're not an entrepreneur, not a business owner, and you can consume all day long, not a problem. But if you are in that space and you've got a message to the world in some way, shape or form, or a product or a service that you wanna promote, and you wanna serve and you wanna make an impact and make a real difference, then the shift needs to go from consuming to creating. Now what do I mean by this? Well, I mean creating something of value consistently and also consuming, because social media is obviously there to connect and consume different information. But one thing that I didn't chat to my mate about on the phone was maybe you're creating, but then when you're consuming, you're looking to create off the back of it. That's a new train of thought. So most of us may jump on social media and we scroll and scroll and scroll. And most of the time we're consuming. We're consuming other people's content. We're consuming what the world is put what the world is putting in front of us. And that's not a bad thing. We need that. But on the flip side, if you're an entrepreneur or business owner, then are you creating at the level that you need to be to be able to make the impact and to make the income and the revenue that you want in your business? Most of us at times aren't. And I'm, I've been guilty of this plenty of times. I just haven't been creating enough. I've been consuming a lot more. But when I made this mindset shift not that long ago that, hey, I need to get more into creation, less into consumption, and as a business owner and entrepreneur, flip this. Flip this to a 90-10. I'm creating 90% of the time and then consuming to create, say 10% of the time, rather than what most of us do, we consume 90% of the time, scroll, 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 like here, share that, click there, and our creation goes out the window. We may only create 10% of the time, or never. So the question is for you, if you feel like that social media is getting the better of you, better of you, that your stuff's not getting seen, that you don't know what to do, that you're just not working hard enough, or you're budging when you're on social media, then the mindset shift is create instead of consume, and then, hey, if you're late at night or you just want a bit of to distraction or zone out or just give your mind a bit of a mental break, then go into consumption. Then go and check out what's going on. Rather than, but do that after you've created. That'll set you up for better results in your business. You'll feel better within yourself also. I know I've made, I've made a massive shift there. I feel a lot better within myself when I'm in creation rather than just consuming. So I'll leave you with a question. Are you creating or are you consuming? Ask yourself that question and make the switches where you need to. Hope this message, this video has been valuable to you. If it has, please share it, please like it, please do those things that you know we all love and appreciate, and I definitely do. And pass it on to someone, a fellow business owner or entrepreneur that you may feel needs to make that shift or may find it valuable. And PM me if you want extra help. If you want extra help, guidance, perspective, insight into this consumption versus creation um, conversation, then PM me, I'm always here to help. And if you want to find out what I'm up to with my amazing uh, partner Ness, head over to timandness.com.au forward slash join revolution. I'll drop it in the comments below and I look forward to having you a part of that. But thank you again for watching and that's it from me today. So bye for now.